Good morning everyone. So this morning I'm outside the Brisbane City Hall and I'm doing a free walking tour from 10am till 1pm. It's currently 9.44 so I'm just chilling, uh, waiting to yeah go to the meeting point in like five minutes. This is the perfect way to uh, you know explore the city on a budget. As someone who's full-time traveling right now I need to keep my, co my costs as low as possible so this is the perfect activity for me and I also have the worst sense of direction ever so uh, in order to get the bearings of the city I thought a free walking tour would be the best way to do it so uh, yeah let's start the tour shall we? I booked my free walking tour with the Brisbane Greeters which is run by volunteers and the tour started at the Brisbane City Hall which is the largest city hall in Australia. Brisbane is the capital and most populated city in the Australian state of Queensland and the third most populated city in Australia. We headed to the Treasury, which has a casino, hotel, restaurants and bars. In Brisbane, they're also building a new casino, which will cost $3.6 billion. I bet you didn't know, Brisbane has 283 days of sunshine a year and in winter it rarely drops below 20 degrees. We then walked through the University of Queensland and the campus was so beautiful. It's also located close to the city's botanic gardens. Another fun fact, the world's first cultivated macadamia tree lives in the botanic gardens. After exploring the botanic gardens, we strolled past the river and headed into the city centre to see the many skyscrapers that fill the city. The tour was absolutely fantastic and if you'd like to check it out, I'll leave a link in the description. What a fantastic free walking tour that was. Hopefully you guys all enjoyed the montage of basically exploring around Brisbane. Uh, Graham was such a fantastic tour guide. There's a about 120 volunteers who do these tours every day around Brisbane and it was uh, yeah about two and a half hours which was absolutely perfect I now feel like I know the city a lot better um, we tried to give him some money at the end but he insisted that we didn't so um, if you are looking for a free activity here in Brisbane this is definitely one that I would recommend um, I'm absolutely starving now so I'm gonna head and get my favorite lunch which is some sushi and then I think I'm gonna do some shopping because I'm in the main shopping area at the moment so I'm gonna get a few more clothes uh, for the rest of my trip um, um, but yeah, really good start to the day. So I've treated myself to an M&M's McFlurry after having some sushi for lunch. Uh, yeah, I'm trying to be healthy at the moment, but it's such a nice day, the sun is shining. And uh, yeah, to celebrate being here in Brisbane, I was like, you know what, I'll treat myself to a McFlurry. So now I'm heading back to the hostel. I'm gonna chill for a couple of hours, get some work done. And then I think I'm gonna head out for a run. I haven't been running for such a long time. <laughs> I did some running on the treadmill when I was in Melbourne, but in terms of like a run outside, it's been months. So uh, I was speaking to my friend Georgia yesterday who used to live here and she has given me a really good route to run. So I think I'm gonna try, yeah. I think try is the, the right word here, try slash attempt a run here in Brisbane. I'm now back at the hostel and I'm gonna spend the next two hours doing some work before heading out for a run. I'm saying this now on the on the vlog to keep me accountable. So if I say I'm gonna go for a run, I will go for a run. Potentially not to the route I was going to go to earlier, potentially just somewhere around the surrounding areas um, because I was gonna run by the botanical gardens, but that's quite a way that way. So I think I'm just gonna stay where I am here. Um, but yeah, that's the plan for the rest of the day. I've got a few things to sort out, add many things, emails. So uh, yeah, let's go going with the rest of the day. So 
as you've probably seen from the lack of uh, running footage, I did not end up going for a run. I just didn't have enough energy to, uh, to head out. I'm thinking tomorrow I'm gonna try and go for a run instead. So fingers crossed I have more energy and I can do that because I really would love to go for a run here whilst I'm in Brisbane. Uh, but yeah, I've just been doing some work for the last couple of hours, uploading a ton of footage onto my laptop to start editing some more vlogs. Uh, it's now three minutes to six and I'm just having some dinner.